Jay Shri Ram. Hello gamers, today I'm gonna test the brutal horror game of all time, The Resident Evil 7. This game is quietly playable on Snapdragon 6 Gen for chipset using Winlater by Onik Ludashi. But some players are facing D3 D1 to error. This problem is there in almost all Resident Evil games, so I have brought a permanent solution to this error, which I will tell you in this video and also tell you the best settings for this game so that you can achieve playable 30 to 50 FPS in the game, so don't miss any part of this video. So let's start with win later container setup. Set up the container exact as shown in the video. Here's the effect score preset, just make a copy of performance preset and enabled so mode. Okay, now launch the container. As you can see, when you launch the game, the D3 D1 to error is shown, so to solve it, go to Start, click on System Tools, and open the Wine Configuration. After that, click on Libraries tab and search for D3 D1 2. Edit it and set the command to Disable. That's it. Click on Apply and create the shortcut for the game. Now, exit the container and launch the game from shortcut. Well, now as you can see, D3 D12 error has solved. This method works for all Resident Evil games, especially for remakes in Resident Evil 7. Now just set the in-game graphics settings to low and enjoy the game.
shouldn't have. All I can say is that if you get this, stay away. Uh, it's Ethan. Oh, hey. You all right? You just disappeared the other night. Yeah. Yeah, no, I'm, I'm good. I'm good. It's Mia. She's not dead. She's alive. She, she's back. They found her? How? What happened? I, I don't know. Look, I, I don't know how, but she's back. She's back somehow. And maybe it's a prank. She wants me to come and get her. Where is she? Dolby. Dolby, Louisiana. I know, I know, but what if it is her? I have to find out what happened.